The hurricane season is just a few months out, and the National Hurricane Center is ready to test out a new forecast graphic that could one day replace the well-known cone of uncertainty. First Alert meteorologist Steve Villanueva breaks down what you can expect. Steve? Well, folks, we're still a few months away from hurricane season, but beginning this hurricane season, the National Hurricane Center is going to start introducing a new experimental cone of uncertainty. This is what the current cone looks like when you go to their website. You can see that along the coast, that's where they issue the watches and the warnings. Those are in the colors. These are hurricane watches and warnings, or tropical storm warning and a hurricane warning. This was for Hurricane Ian, and then they put the cone on top of it. So that's the way it's currently done. But with the new experimental one that they will issue in mid-August, they're going to move the watches and warnings farther inland. So you can pick where you live and see if you will be affected by hurricane force winds or tropical storm force winds. Again, this is only experimental and it will be issued in addition to the current watch and warning and cone map that they currently use. It won't affect the way we put our weather graphics on television. This is only at the website for the National Hurricane Center.